Okay, I give up. After a very lengthy period of looking in my Prius manual here, my Toyota manual for the firing order um, of the engine, I, I can't find it. Even when you do find the uh, firing order uh, heading, it gives you the plug, the gap, the torque, no firing order. Useless. Okay. Let me show you how you can figure it out on the car on your own, if you have a scope available, two channels. So come out to your car, whatever car that may be, this is my Prius C. You can see I've got uh, four coil on plugs and what I've done is all I've done there's no fancy probe or anything just take the lead number one channel in uh, the case of the modus it's channel one um, just use channel one as your sync channel so what you're going to do is you're going to use this channel in order to um, establish where uh, cylinder one actually fires and use that as a reference point so here on the scope you can see here Here's cylinder uh, ignition coil one firing, and there it's repeating again. This is the noise from the other coils. So that's cylinder one firing there, that's cylinder one firing there. So that's 720 degrees of rotation of the, of the crankshaft. Make sense? Okay, so take your label that I've made here. So that's one. Take channel two, which you have. You just put that on the next coil. This is coil two. You see where it's firing there? You see there's coil two firing right there. There's two. Take your probe, put it on the third coil. There's three firing right there. So be quick about this. This is a hybrid, guys. It's going to shut down as soon as the battery comes up to the threshold. There's coil four, and you can see where coil four is firing. There's the firing order. Simple, straightforward. You don't need to piss around with the uh, connector on the four coil. Wires. There's four wires on here. Now, if you want to go ahead and figure out which wire is which, obviously there's a power, there's a ground, uh, there's a trigger, and there's a feedback. Uh, confirmation of the coil actually firing this being a Toyota but it's a pain in the ass right you know you have to dig in there you have to uh, figure out which wire is which this way simple straightforward you really can't go wrong I think you can see here guys because the trigger is in normal is holding the last trace right so there's one there's three firing there's four there's two what's the firing order of this particular engine one three four two Simple, straightforward, any decent scope will do it. Some guys ask me to be particular about, um, you know, showing them how you actually hook it up, guys. So all I've done here is these are the, uh, um, these are the signal paths from the two lanes, and there's also uh, a ground, of course, right? These two, these two leads are actually shielded, so the ground is jumped to a common point. These are stackable, and you can see here I've just got it grounded on the uh, valve cover here, right? That's it. You can do the same if you have a BNC setup. Nothing fancy, no fancy probes. All I've done is tape this one to the number one ignition coil so we can keep it there as a reference point. Use the channel two to move along, checking your coils one at a time, and just apply your labels uh, in the relative location where the strike actually shows up. Any decent scope will do it. That's why I've got my modus out here, guys. Okay, that's it, boys. Cheers.